is about ready to get underway here at Lawler Ring. As the Warriors bench clamoring during the opening faceoff, as this one's muscled forward for DeCare. For the Black Bears, now a chance here for Belts as she gets behind the fence. Skates in alone, goes forehand, shot, and she scores. Off the blocker of Demare, and it just finds its way inside the near post. So 29 seconds into the second period, Ali Belts gets her third goal of the season and breaks the scoreless tie. As Aaron Hamlin goes with the 5-4 unit here. On the power play, Grant Mentis able to split the defense. Now Grant Mentis fires, scores! Ripped it top shelf. Power play goal for Grant Mentis. Ties the score here, one to one, early in the second period. Well defended, now maybe a two on one the other way here for the Black Bears. Giving it belts again, she breaks it alone. Belts drops off and it's swiped in there. Tiedenby with the yawning cage wide open. And so back to back to back goals are now Maine back ahead two to one. Now Tenby between the hash marks fires and scores. Tenby with the power play goal, her second tally of the afternoon, makes it a 3 1 lead here for the Black Bears late in the second period. Cook back to Roust off the wall. Now uh, over to. Grant Mentis shot and a score there on the rebound. The initial stop made by Porter, but right there was Castino with the extra attacker to pull the Warriors within one. Two on three, Grant Mentis from the circle will fire. Blocker saved by Porter. Castino back over to Grant Mentis. Center pass, cut free, and Rouse scores. No one picked up the defenseman at top of the crease, and the pass made its way through traffic. Right there to Kiki Rouse. She has her first of her collegiate career to tie the score three to three with 5-10 to go. And Jones. Able to sauce over to Grant Mentis. Grant Mentis able to pull free, goes back, hit shot, and she scores! All the moves there, forehand, backhand, and tucks it past Lauren Porter. And the first hockey's victory this season for the Warriors in overtime. Grant Mentis gained the overtime game-winning tally to win it 4-3 for Merrimack.